welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, hi, my name is Twee and this is my boyfriend, Quang. Hey guys, so we're here today to film another video for you guys. Today, we're gonna see what I picked out on Pretty Little Things for Twee. We actually got like 400 pounds worth of products in here, a big bag full. Me and my sister was literally watching Graham pick out outfits for a good hour. He was so confused. What is co-ords? Where is the tots? Where are the jeans and stuff like that? And we was literally laughing at all the stuff he was putting in his basket because, spoiler alert guys, they were not cute. I was literally like, oh, I would never wear that. How was the experience online shopping? It was so difficult guys. So many pages and so much to pick from. I'm more of an old school type of person where I like to go to the shop, try it on. If I like it, I buy it because there's only a handful of stuff that you like in store. Going online, having so much variety, not having it in person is so much harder. But you can see it on the model. There's so much more choice. There's so much variety. Don't you like that? All the options you can have. You just buy it and return if you don't want it. The reason it's harder online is because you don't know how it looks on you, but it might look good in the model. This is the problem. The Instagram versus reality life. So do you guys think that he'll do well? I'm going to put a poll up here. Do you think you've done well? Probably not. Okay, guys, so if you guys want to see Graham pick out my outfits, please keep watching. Roll the intro. <laughs> The first outfit that I pulled out of the Pretty Little Thing bag is this number. I can't remember. I must have got catfish from the image. I can see where you was going though, because you know I like sequins and you know I like bright colours. So I can see where it was kind of going. Got this massive frill here, which I don't know what the frill is about. Okay, maybe we have high hopes for this on, but first impression, it looks like someone's curtain. Also, by the way, guys, I'm not going to be cutting off any of these things because I'm probably going to return the things that Graham bought for me. Okay, guys, so this is what Graham's first dress looks like on. I think the frills are a bit too much though. Do I look like a flamingo? <laughs> Do I look like I'm gonna fly? Do you like it? Do you like what you're seeing? No, I think the frills are a bit too much. Why did you pick this out though? What did you like about it? I think it's the colour of the sequence. Kind of had a little bit of ruching on the arm, which is a bit weird because I don't know why you'd want to look like you've got one thick ass arm because there's like so much fabric on here. I do like the colour. I feel like if it was a different cut, it would look so much better. Like, even if it was just a boob tube, it would look so much nicer. But I don't know how I feel about the whole one arm situation. It could be a bit tired. Look at all this extra space. Is it what you imagined it would be? No, um, it's a no for me return. Hopefully this is not every single outfit. Can you guys imagine partying the night away in this? Frilly, frilly, frilly! <laughs> flap your tits. <laughs> this is a good one to flap your tits. Ooh, what is this? A pink oversized blazer. Okay, did it go over set or you just got a blazer by itself? T was meant to have something like a white t-shirt, but I couldn't find a white t-shirt. It's like a blazer on top of your white t-shirt. What pants am I wearing? Did you pick pants for me? No. Wait, you're supposed to pick full outfits! <laughs> you have to make it work. What? Maybe, are you joking? Maybe we skip that one for now. Maybe there'll be something else in here that I can pair this up with. Why did you pick full freaking outfit? It's just so annoying. Plus this blazer's so ugly. Why would you ever pick this blazer? It looks nice on the photo. But why is it the material so horrible? The buttons. Like these are literally like grandma buttons. What the hell did you ever see in this? Okay, we'll move on to the next outfit. So I guess you have the poo emoji in your mind when you decide to pick this colour out, right? This is a colour I would have never ever picked. Okay, Rooshin. I don't think that colour will suit you. I don't know what I was thinking when I picked these clothes. This is meant for you. They don't care about anything. They don't put their 100% commitment to anything. Did you pick stuff that you thought I would like or did you pick stuff that you would like to see me in? I don't know. I try a bit of both. Half, half. Grand slogan of life. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, guys, we'll try this one on. What is this? It's so cool. much fabric. If this was in a different colour, it would be so much nicer. Like if it was in white or something, the colour is just not something I would ever, ever pick. I do feel like it makes my body look good though, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I probably picked it because of the ruching. The ruching makes your body more curvy. How do you know that? Well, do you like the arms? I personally hate wearing clothes that I like baggy. Like if it's like got loads of bunch here, I won't wear it. I thought it would fit you a bit better. No, it's what it has meant to be. You're trying to make it fit. It's meant to be a big sleeve like this. You must have pinned it, I'm saying. But you think you should be like that? <laughs> no. <laughs> this is how no, Greg styles me, guys. He wants me to be all covered up. Let me show you what this dress looked like when I initially put it on, okay? It was like, Papa, like this. <laughs> it's a long ass day. This dress, you can wear it a bit longer. So if you want it to be a bit more elegant or whatever. But you know, the thought over here, she likes it short. Yes. Oh, how are you, Willie? Yeah, you want to pull my tampon string? Okay, so how do you feel about this one? Do you think I should keep this one? Do you like it? No, nope, it's a no for me, return. You picked the wrong reason. I feel like that would be tired. Cut it off. 
Like, look at that on the camera then. Maybe change the colour. I don't think the colour is too nice. The colour though, that's something, yeah, you saw on the photo. I don't know why you picked it out. I don't know, I thought it would just be something different, but the colour in person is not that nice. I actually don't think the sleeves are that bad. Gran really hates the sleeve. I actually don't think it's that bad. It's just the colour I just don't personally like. If this was on like a deeper skinned girl, I think this would look amazing. But on me, it just doesn't look the best. Like, there's other nicer colours out there, you know what I'm saying? Okay, well, this video is going downhill, isn't it? Okay, guys, so this one I'm actually really excited about. I do have to say that I had to nudge Grang to get this outfit because when he was shopping, oh, I was like, oh my God, that looks so nice. And he kept scrolling past it. And then I had to keep making these remarks like, oh, you didn't pick anything nice. You scrolled past all the nice ones. And then he got the hint that I liked this outfit. First glance, do you like it? Depends how you put it on because it might be pinned in the model. But really, it's like a big sack. <laughs> Let's try this on and hopefully this won't cram up my ass crack and give me cystitis. You're disgusting. <laughs> Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let down your hair. I knew it wasn't going to fit nice on you. Shut up, it looks lovely. But it's definitely one of those things that looks so lovely on the model and on me looks like a big sack of potatoes. Okay, I like the idea of the corset style and how it goes really, really tight. It's actually a really good size fit, the top. But imagine this for an Instagram photo, if we was in Mykonos. Again, I think there's too much fabric. Really? It makes you look too wide. Oh my God, I love the wide hip. I think if Hun was here, she would love this outfit. I actually prefer the skirt more than the top, I think, because the top, I don't know, like this bit, I think it needs to be a bit tight on the top and then just the bottom bit is the loose puffy part. When it's together, it looks like you're just a big puff. I personally didn't like it, that's why I didn't pick it. Shake that ass, make your ass look fat because of the ruffles, guys. Okay, well, what don't you like about it? I think it's just too ruffle puffle. <laughs> ruffle puffle, the words of Grand, quote of 2020. You look like a ruffle puffle. Okay, I don't know how I feel about this. I'm not gonna lie. I did see it in the model. She looked amazing. We'll set photos of what the model looks like in all of these outfits and what Gran got catfished by. Imagine this with no arms and just the boob tube. Don't you think that looks so much better? Yes, look at that body figure. Yeah, it's giving you all types of illusion. And then when you add the arms, it's like, oh, another L. With I don't take L's, guys. This is your L. I see potential. I see some stripes. Oh, hello. Why is it cycling, you two? That's what you picked, Greg. I can see where you was going with this, you know, the motorsport vibe. I can see why you picked this, but it's definitely like an Instagram versus reality moment. I don't know if it's because it's all crinkled and it just come out of the packaging, that's why it doesn't look nice. Do you remember picking this? I think so. I think it was like a kind of like sporty effect. Sporty effect. What is up with the sleeve? Why is the sleeve elasticated? Oh my god. Literally making me feel so constrained. I feel like I'm bulging out of it. My biceps are bulging, you know what I'm saying? Oh, there's not even no pockets. Print at the back? Nope, there's no print at the back either. When you was on the website, did you not like click the other images to see what it looked like at the back? Do you not click on no. the video where the model walks in the catwalk? Do you not see the video? I always watch the videos, guys. You need like, you know, like the sit down. He needs you like stick this your leg out like that. Like yeah. this. No for me, sorry guys. Boo. Okay, Gran, what is this? Another little rooshy roosh? I picked a lot of dresses, I think. I was in the dress section for a long time because you don't have to pair with anything else. Really? So I created a full outfit from one piece of clothing. So that's why I like jumpsuits and playsuits. And I was telling you about cohorts. I was navigating but him through the website. Cohorts, you have to buy the top and the bottoms. It's just too long, man. Okay, so what do you think about this? Out, do you remember picking this out? You have to try rouge stuff on because you can actually not see the curves, yeah? But the curves are coming, guys, in three, two, one. Mmm. This looks so much better with a thicker strap. Why yeah. is it such a skinny strap? So it goes thick here and then goes thin. I think the rouge bottom looks nice. Yeah. This needs a bit of work. Well, you say you didn't like the square neckline, but did you not see that when you picked out this item? Is it ruched all the way around? Or is it straight? Well, your bum's stretching the material, so you know. Okay, one, I hate the colour. It's not vibrant, it's like they turn down the saturation on the colour. But I guess some people would like this kind of like muted kind of tones, but for me, I like things to be vibrant. Like, if you're gonna be teal, you better be teal, bitch. Like, I wanna see the green tones, I wanna see the blue tones in it. I would never normally choose anything that's a square neckline, because I feel it doesn't look as flattering. It makes you look a bit more top heavy. Also, anything with like really, really thin straps like this, you have to be super, super careful, because if it's unadjustable, this is what happens. Because, like I said, every one of my try-on videos, 
I have a short torso. <laughs> the shirt is to be adjustable, guys. And also, this is like one of those things that's just like a blah outfit. Like, where would you ever wear this to, babes? I'm not gonna be too harsh on guy because I do see where he was going. He knows that I like the rouge. He knows from editing all my videos that I like colours and stuff like that. So I can see where he was kind of going. He just didn't hit the nail on the head, you know what I'm saying? But I do give you credit for trying. Okay, next. I don't like it, we've turned in it. Let's just scrap this video, guys. This video might not even be uploaded, guys. Oh, God. I already have this. Well, it's a good sign, then, if you already have it. Oh, no, because I hated it and I returned it. Actually, I don't have this. Okay, Gwang. I had a sheer top like this in the same material, so I thought it was the same thing. But this one actually looks a lot nicer than the one I picked out, so well done for that. How is it looking for you? I don't know. I don't really like the colour. It's got one of those things inside, so you're not <laughs> naked. Okay, so we're gonna try this on. I actually feel like it looks quite ugly here, but I think once you try it on, it'll look nice. It's one of those catfish moments where it looks really bad on the shelf, but it looks good on the body. Okay, guys, this is a very tight little number. Be it pulled up more. So what do you do with that string there? You just let it dangle? Yeah, it's just like a tampon string, isn't it? I don't like the colour. Do you like the colour? <laughs> bad well, it could be more vibrant i guess could be more yeah. goldish yeah the color's a bit blah i think the ruching makes the body look good i quite like the fact that the arms are sheer but then the body bit has a little t-shirt thing underneath it so this bit looks like the same kind of color but then the arms are still like a bit see-through i think i like the ruching on you but i like that color i thought it'd be more shiny in person yeah i thought it would be a lot more shimmery that's also the reason why i returned my last one because the material on the camera that they were shooting in on the Pretty Little Thing website. It actually looked really nice and like golden and sparkly. In real life, it looks more like a muted kind of gold, which they could have made it more vibrant, you know? Actually, I think that it doesn't cut it for me. No? Mm -hmm. Doesn't make the mark? Because the dress is something that you have to wear it to like a certain event that and you have to look good, it doesn't cut it for me. So this is good, but not good enough. Graham is rejecting all of his choices that he made in life. What on earth is this? I've worn something like this before. You have the Maury colour one, didn't you? Grand, that was so, like, circa 2000. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit, it's got strings. Yes, if you would have scrolled along with the images, you would have seen what it looks like at the back. Okay, so Grand decided to dress me up like a little ruffle buffle again. Okay, you want to see me twerking this, innit? That's why you chose it, innit? Hello, flapper girl. I feel like I'm going to a carnival or something. There's a lot of skin for the back. There's a lot of ham hanging out, guys. And there's also some ass coming out. Is this why you chose it? No, I didn't see the ass on the back. You can only see it once you twerk and you shake it. I personally am not that confident with my back, so I try not to get things that like expose my back too much because I notice that when I'm sitting down and stuff like that, I've got a lot of rolls on my back. Like, like if I sit down, look, look at this. I've never seen you wear like stringy stuff. Yeah, I don't wear anything that kind of reveals my back because whenever I sit down or anything like that, or if I get caught when I'm posing, I twist to the side, I get these fucking like rolls here. And it's hard to face tune out, guys, let me tell you. So just avoid it at all costs. Unless you've got like a slim muscular back and you've been doing your bench presses, then cover up that back, bitch. It looks okay from the front, but I think that more colour would be better. Well, baby, you chose black, what do you mean? These are proper like hot pants though. They're literally like right into your knicker line. I would have chose something like this like maybe three years ago, but now it's time to change, honey, you know? But this actually does hide the belly though, which is good. That covers your belly, look. So you can see my belly? Yeah, it's a no for me, guys. <laughs> To the returns pile! Okay, we have another blue number. You seem to like blue. You like cobalt blue, that's why. Velvet. Yeah, I saw it was velvet. You have to try on. Okay. And ruche it. Yep, it's a ruche again. <sighs> Do you have high hopes for this then? No. Baby, it needs to be more positive. Personally, I don't like velvet myself. So why did you pick it, Gwang? A full of nice old girls. Doesn't look that bad, actually. Okay, you like it? Got a nice shine to it. Okay. Maybe because it's the lighting. I like it. This is very cute. This is like how we said the brown dress. We wanted the sleeves to be a bit tighter. Well, here it is. Yeah. And it's in a better colour. I actually really like stuff that ruches out, especially in the middle like this, when it gives you more of like a heart shape here because it makes your bum look fat. You know, it gives you that proper like hourglass shape. This is what it looks like from the back. The booty is fat. You're nasty. Yeah, I like it. You like it? This bit here is a bit chunky for me. No, I like it. I prefer it when it goes like this. I'm very particular what I like. If I pick something for myself, if there's a button or a pocket that's too big, I'll be like, no, I don't like that pocket. <laughs> I think you'll look like a 
bad bitch with that outfit. It'd be a good Instagram photo. Oh my god, yeah, it would. I actually really like this outfit, Greg. It's something that I would choose myself, which I give you very good props for. This is my favourite outfit so far. You have redeemed yourself, Greg. Is it a winner, winner, chicken dinner? It is. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. I think you need like a bling clutch or something. Carry it like this. Okay, I see the vision, Greg, yes. Yeah, with some badass heels. You keeping it? Yeah, I like it, you know. Bing, 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 bing. Yay, we have a keeper. Okay, what else is in this bag? Okay, so the next one, he wanted me to be a little slut. Oh, we got some vinyl here. Is that what you like, yeah? I think there might be a top to go with it. Three loves a bit of Christina Aguilera. Oh my goodness me, you want me to be a dominatrix, okay. Oh, okay, Gwen. This is very cool. This is something that I would have never seen you pick out. This song was so tight. That's got a be... weird sound. It's like, meow, 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 meow. I think it is from Lil Mix Collection. I personally don't like it. Babe, why did you change it? Guys, there is no zip on the skirt. Why on earth would you make a PVC skirt and not make a freaking zip? I was so close to making it explode going up my hips. I thought this would look horrible on, but now looking at the camera, I actually don't think it looks that bad. But I love stuff like this. It's very like daring. She looks like a bad bitch in this. I can imagine it's like a low ponytail like this. Like, yes. I don't think it looks bad. I actually think that it looks like something I would wear to an event when I want to look like a baddie. I think you have to be a baddie to put it off. Ow. I actually thought that it would be really, really like tight on, but now that I've worn it for a couple of minutes now, I've kind of got used to it. The only thing about this skirt is that it's super, super tight here. So if you're sitting down, bitch, you're gonna have rolls. Like the rolls are gonna hang like this. You know what I'm saying? This Hello, blueberry muffin. So you have to make sure you pull the skirt on top of the flab, keep it all contained in. But apart from that, I quite like it. I think this will make a very bad Instagram photo. Okay, but do you like it? It's not too bad. The more I look at it, the more I get used to it and like it. So if I wore this and I went inside the bedroom, would you be like, what the fuck is that? I would, yeah. Initially you would? Yeah, initially I would. I'd be like, what the fuck are you wearing? <laughs> It is kind of one of those outfits that you're like, from first glance, you're like, what is she wearing? But after, I'm like, oh, I see your vibe, girl. I see where you go with it. Okay, but yeah, I do like this, babe. Well done. Does it make the booty look good? This makes it look shiny. You want to wax this ass? Oh, this is a good one to slap, babe. Uh, Ace of our smacking ass. What the hell's got a big cut out? What on earth did you get, Gray? Oh my god, this is gonna have so much muffin rolls, it's actually gonna be crazy. What did she pick, babe? I don't know. So I'm gonna just cut a triangle out, a slice of pizza out of your body. You're literally gonna see pizza rolling all out of this dress. Maybe it's one of those things that'll look nice on. So you can either wear it like this or you can ruche it up, which you know my ass is gonna do because I love me some ruching. Ooh, it might look snatched with the ruche, babes. It doesn't ruche on this side though, it's so annoying. I like the colour, I feel like it look better. If it would be one piece. Because this pizza thing is like, just missing. But do you know what? It's not even that bad, it's quite cool. It looks like a proper like cold, but it's a dress. So you'll never ever lose the top. But I do actually really like the colour. You can't really see on camera, but in real life it looks a bit more peachy. It has a definitely more of an orange tone to it. I actually thought that I would hate the sleeves because it kind of looks a bit Grand Murray and it's got a square neck again. But this one actually doesn't look that bad. It's actually really comfortable on. I think that even if I wore this with like flip flops, it would still look quite like casual because of the sleeves. Oh yeah. Oh, I actually quite like this one, Gran. Well done. Okay, what was your favourite outfits on me? I think the favourite one was the blue dress. This one's nice and casual. Okay. You might get a tan line, though, from a pizza. Look at you, fell asleep with pizza on your belly. I actually thought this one, you would have a lot more, like, rolls and stuff, but the material is actually really nice and, like, soft and slinky, so it doesn't, like, pinch you in or anything like that. And I feel like if you sit down, this fabric will just cover it up because it's so soft. It will just like roll into place, you know what I'm saying? Okay, my worst outfit that I definitely would not have chosen was the blue dress, the initial one, the first one. So that was definitely my least favorite. And my most favorite was the other blue dress. I really like this and I also like the black outfit that we tried on before, the PVC one. That was very snatched and something that I would actually choose. This one I'm the most surprised by because I would have never chose this. Like in a hundred years, I would have just scrolled past it. But now that I'm actually trying it on, I actually really like it. Okay guys, so that's it for the clothing haul. How do you guys think Grant did? Did you guys like the outfits that he picked out? Grant actually done a good job. He kind of knew that I liked sequins. He kind of had a little bit of an idea of what I liked. Like he knew I liked sparkly stuff and sequiny stuff, didn't you? Yeah. Sometimes it just looks a bit tacky, you know? You can't just pick anything that's sequiny, guy. I think I got catfished by the 100 people bought this today. 16 people bought this today. <laughs> that is 
that gets you when it's like top seller, best seller, you know, it makes you want to click on it even faster. But apart from that, thank you so much for trying at least. Your efforts are very well appreciated. So please show Grang some love down below in the comment section. If you guys want to see a bit more of Grang, I do feature him a lot in our weekly vlog. So make sure you check that out. It goes out every single Sunday. We are committed to you guys. So make sure you stay updated with our lives on our weekly vlogs and also follow Grang on Instagram as well. What's your Instagram handle? It's QP underscore underscore. So check it out. And also Grang will leave every single item in the description box just in case you guys actually liked his outfit choices and want to pick it up for yourself. And that's it for this video, guys. I'm gonna make Pretty Little Things so much money now. See, affiliate links. My picks as well. Go rack it in. We don't even get any money from Pretty Little Thing. Imagine if Pretty Little Thing notices me from Greg's video. Anyway, guys, we'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Bye. Why are you so robotic? You're like, um, so I'll see you. you look like you're reading through a teleprompter. Just be free. Loosen up. Jiggle those tits. That is my jiggle tits. <laughs> oh, snooze fest. I need a haircut. You look fine, babe. What is up with boys and their haircuts? Like, literally, it's such a big thing for look, them. Man. No one cares! You literally look exactly the same. This is a good thumbnail. Why like, do you have this emoji this whole time? <laughs> <laughs> Who remembers these? Look. Smack that ball. Oh, <laughs> no, no, just stuck on. Smack that ass! Smack it! I can't remember what I picked out. Been so long now. Right. You don't want to expose the secrets. <laughs> you picked this out yesterday, remember? Oh! <laughs> You're gonna get it when you're sleeping, when you're snoring, it's gonna go right to the back of your throat. You're gonna fuck off, guys. Oh, Papa sings that fish. Get some of that. Why is it so fishy? It's like, hush, hush, fish, fish. It's not that bad. All right. All right, guys. All right. Do right. 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 so I look fat in it? No. Was that a trick question? Yes, that was a trick question. You asked it correctly. Well done. Ah!